Right, good morning, or afternoon, should I say, when you get this. Um, it's very early, and I'm thinking I'm going to be away Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and I'll be here Sunday, but I won't be able to do this. So, I'm thinking, what are you going to do when I'm not here? Not that I should care what you're going to do, and not that you should care, but I care, if that makes sense. Not that you're obliged to be here, is what I mean to say. Um... But I'm very soon, I may, may, in inverted commas, need to make some books for something that I can't really talk about yet. Um, I've got sticky tape on here, I don't know why. Um, so what I'm thinking is, I could build up a stock of things, you know, like when I was making my books, I said I had a stock of painted pieces and stitched pieces that went into those books. I just needed to cut up and put in the books. So I'm going to maybe try and make a few things with you over those today um, and then Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But having said that, one of those days might be different. I might think of something else to put on on a different day. It might not be this constantly. And I won't be doing the same thing as I'm doing today either. So if you're not confused now, you will be in a minute. Right, so what I've done basically is I've got a piece of paper um, and so far, this is vintage ribbon that I bought in Paris um, a few years ago now. I'm not an international jet setter, but it was a study trip with uni in 2005, I think, or maybe six, two 2006 maybe. Um, so I bought this and I've still got it, I've used very little of it. Um, so that's on the paper and I've put a raw French knots down there. And I've created some texture here. Um, so what I want to do now, there's, I want to put a colour in it, not just white French knots. So I've looked at the ribbon, and you might not be able to tell, but it's very subtle colourways. There's like a dark blue and a pale blue, and then there's like a mossy green. Now I've got in here, this isn't my thread stash, but this is where my new ones are. And in here I've got greens, but they're quite vibrant. They're more for use in the things that I put on my blog, like yesterday with the silk and the doodling and stuff. But I have managed to find what I think is quite a subdued green, a mossy green. So the first thing I want to do is do some white ones, French knots, and then do a couple of green ones and see if that lives. Now, you might not be able to tell that while I'm doing it from your point of view, because obviously, you know, I've already got some in a needle, so I don't need to thread a needle. Um, need to put a knot in it though so but you will i'll take a picture so then you'll get a sense properly of how it looks something still that you can look at i mean i can i know i say this all the time but i can pull the camera in but it tends to blur and i've got a habit of when the camera's pulled in of getting carried away with what i'm doing and i end up moving the camera away out of the sight of the of the work away out of the sight of the camera so you're basically looking at nothing like an empty table so I think it's better to rely on the image for you to get a true sense of what's going on. So I'm going to London to stay with my little girl. I'm going to do some Christmas shopping. I'm going to miss the final, the X Factor. That's doing my head in. But I suppose I can uh, tape it and watch it on Sunday. But anyway. So it'll be all Christmas shopping and Christmas trees and keep an eye on Instagram because I'll probably be like overloading Instagram to such a degree that they kick me off. So just a few white ones. I'm not going to do a French knot in every hole on here. Um, just, they're just going to be scattered. But I'm hoping that what's going to happen is when I add the green ones, they're going to lift this. Don't ask me why I started there and went up that way. Because now I'm stuck up there. And I need to come down here. But I'll come back down by means of more French knots. Um, and then when this white's run out, I won't finish all the white ones. I'll start adding some green up here where I've got the white. If that makes sense. So, now where I've took that sticky tape off this board on the right you can't see my cardigan is sticking to it and I'm just just ignore that that's my telephone just ignore it it won't be important 
I do apologise for the noise in the background. Maybe we could sing a song to drown it out. I is not going to answer it. So be persistent anyway. So yeah, so I'll do this be like finish off now because I need to fasten that off. Um it's loud, isn't it? I should have turned it off. I can turn the ring off. I should have done that. I'm gonna do that in a minute. Right, so then get some uh, the persistent, get some of this green and put a couple of these in. If it's urgent, they'll ring my mobile. And if my mobile starts ringing, I'm in trouble because that's right next to me. Go away. I hope you're all singing jingle bells to drown that out. I'm just putting a knot in this green thread. It's one of the perils of working from home. I know I should have turned it off, I still mostly do. Um, people think, oh, she's at home, I'll ring her up. You don't think, oh, she might be busy. Oh, for goodness sake, oh, stop already. Right, so let's... So we'll have a couple of green. Now this I can already see. Oh, they've given up. I can already see that that looks well there. It really does look well. It was a good choice of colour. If my mobile starts, I'm going to have to turn off. There. Oh yeah, this is really nice. I do like it a lot, so I'm really glad I chose this one. Because like I say, it's more subdued than the ones I've got in the bag. They're a bit in your face, which is okay. Obviously I haven't bought them if I didn't like them. But different colours obviously suit different um, pieces and different scenarios. Yeah, no, let's see, I made you a video on what you listen to my phone ring. I'm so spoiling you. So much. Lovely. Very, very happy with this. Very happy. Now, will I do anything else to this piece, you're wondering? Well, I'm wondering that myself, to be honest. I don't know. Sometimes less is more. Looks really nice. I'm really, really pleased with that. And so now I need to think. You forget, you know, I need to think what else I need to make. The box. Um, so that I've got a good stock of things if I do end up having to make make some with this certain thing that might be happening. Um, I think one more here because then I'll have to tie it off. You know, I can't even get one more out of that because it's not long enough. So I'm going to take it back through and fasten it off. Um, Oops, it's, it's even come out of my needle now. I'd rather fasten it off a little bit more, just to be sure. I don't want anyone to buy a book and then say, oh, useless that book, everything fell to pieces after a week. Can you imagine? The shame, the shame of it. Right, there. Now, like I say, I will hopefully get a good picture, even though it's dark as night. Um, that's how it looks. I think that green is like the icing on the cake for me. That finishes it off really, really well. Okay, I do apologise about the telephone. It was out of my control, apart from the fact I should have turned it off. Okay. <laughs>